good blackout. Use the bike to reach Damien. Okay. We are almost done, wow. All the way. Okay, we maybe we don't need to. Why are you so damn stubborn? Quinn's dead. You got your sister back, and Clara? She stabbed you in the back. She helped kill your precious Lena. You know it's true. What about you? Some might blame you for Lena's death. I wonder who would think that, huh? But why stop there? Perhaps we should blame you. As I recall, the Murloc job was your plan. I blame myself every day for the plan, for meeting you, for not stopping you when I had the chance. I don't make that mistake anymore. I see a problem, I step in. Oh yes, the vigilante. I've read your headlines. You're the only problem I see now, and I'm coming for you. Okay. Expect it to be difficult or easy. Or have we... no. I enjoyed this series. I really have enjoyed it apart from the... That's a layout. And, and the... Power's still running out there. That's Damien. Okay. 300 meters away. I'll probably... Probably be playing South Park. As well as my next series, I'm not sure. Okay, I'm stuck. Okay, let's get in. And this is going to be a big file as well. I'm not sure, because it was on already 411 GB. My D drive, that is. As you can see, it's starting lagging now. Okay, maybe not. Let's go this way. Let's get our gun out. Can we go this way now? Oh, can I? Okay. Is that it? Nothing to see? Okay. <coughs> okay, so. Let's just get behind the rocks. Mm. Okay, up and down, up and down. decided to pool our talents, the schemes yeah. we were planning. <laughs> we had so much drive, but never like this. Look outside. We've taken down a goddamn city. Okay, let's work it up. Ah, that's the lift. Come on. Good. Now can I reach that up there? Okay. Now I'm spending my final hours standing on the widow's walk. That's what they call the lighthouse what, lookout. What can I have my gun on? The widow's walk. <laughs> Did you know that? I didn't. Seems fitting. Everything reeks of conclusion. Come on, which way? This way? Well, it's only one way anyway. Come on. Here we go. Come on. Surprise, surprise. You got a speech, Damien? Anything you want to say? They know who I am now. That's it? That's all you got? Hey, fuck you! Look at you! You plowed over people to get to a mob boss. You think you're absolved because your cause is what? Noble? You played me. 
That's what this is about. I played you! Clara is as much your fault. So is your niece. That's why you sent your family away, right? They know what you are. You play a beautiful game, but sometimes you still lose. Blah, blah, blah. Jesus, you guys talk a lot. What are you doing here? Sorry, pal. New contract. Uh oh. Kick it over. What? Come on, kick it over. Shit. Oh, you're hilarious. You know, you guys take things far too personally. That's your problem. That's why this went wrong. There's lessons to be learned here, fellas. Up, 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 phone two. Give it to me. Didn't you pick up another phone? Come on, hand it over. Okay. Bye bye. I don't know what Damien wanted in those final moments. Death, I suppose. I thought I could fix a little girl's death, but instead it led to all of this. Exposed lies, corrupted kings, a broken city, and me, changed man. I don't look back anymore. I don't regret. I look forward. Everything is connected, and I'll use that to expose, to protect, and if necessary, to punish. Well, my first game completed, guys. I hope you enjoyed this series. So, yeah, it's been a great adventure, great storyline. Once again, Mayor Rushmore is dead. Police are not revealing any information. The leaked documents found extensive corruption and deep ties between the mayor and the Chicago South Club leader, Lucky Quinn. Did the mayor kill himself over this exposure, or was he executed? So, guys. Oh, Being Jesus Director Christ. of Public Relations, Charlotte Gardner, has issued a statement yeah, regarding the recent this. CTOS troubles. We knew all along that our CTOS network would be a target for hackers of all strengths and skills. It's been an excellent proving ground to demonstrate how robust our system really is. We're so pleased with the results. Our firewall security withheld the worst of the attacks, and in some cases, trip switches closed the systems off before any access could be gained. Your personal information remains secure. Our CTOS network is restored to full operations. Okay, I hope you enjoyed this series. If you uh, enjoyed this, leave a like, leave a In comment, a we want to spend and uh, yeah, ones. subscribe. Be active See in you soon, guys. Have safer, healthier homes and cities. Bloom Industries listen to you and your needs. We are embarking on a global journey. We want the world to be a community. CTOS 2.0, focusing on you, putting you on the global stage. CTOS 2.0. Making smart cities even smarter. Is with us. Dr. Mendez, your story is extraordinary. You actually know Aiden Pierce, the man we know as the vigilante. Tell us how that came about. I met Mr. Pierce through the family, his sister. This was a surprise to us. We couldn't find any information about him at all. It's great that you've come forward. You were treating her son for trauma? Yes, well, naturally, I can't discuss any of that. Not even their names. No, 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 no. We wouldn't ask you to. But that's how you met Aiden Pierce. What's he like? It's impossible to say for certain what he's really like. He masks his personality, and he's very good at it. Is he? It isn't like someone playing poker. This is a very smart man who is looking to gain the upper hand in every situation. And you're writing a book. Yes, I am. It's a book about the whole experience. A study on Mr. Pierce. I really wanted to explore this complex man's mind. I'm sure it'll be a fascinating read. Dr. Mendez, thank you. That sick has had enough. 
Critical warnings have fallen on deaf ears. Our reputation has been attacked by weaklings such as default. Heed our final warning. There will be a reckoning. We are vigilant against the Watchers. We are capable. We are unstoppable. We are at war. And as the search continues for the vigilante known as the Fox, top brass in the Chicago Police Department are urging city and state governments to allow stricter penalties against those who commit crimes in the name of law and order. Anyone who follows in the Fox's footsteps will, quote, be prosecuted to the fullest extent of the law. I'm holding up. I got one last bone for you to chase. Maurice finally gave in, then suddenly he was all talk. I'll give you a location, the rest you can work out yourself. That's business, huh? Yeah, that's right. It's all business. Jordy's like that. Tidy fixer. Keeps the loose ends clean. Maurice is one of his loose ends. And he's ultimately my problem. He's the one who shot my car. Killed my niece. I want to say we're different, but... I don't know anymore. How many people have I hurt? Killed. Who deserves to die? Who decides that? Okay, maybe not this episode over. Uh, is there any more? No? Is that it? Who is that? One, two, three, five. One, two, three, five. What are you doing? You ain't finished it off. Clean off some loose ends. <laughs> Hmm, okay. I know you'd be back. Guys like us, we don't know when to stop. Hmm. Okay, that's it. Definitely over. Over now. <laughs> okay. Thanks to you, CTOS Network has had a successful year. With CTOS Chicago setting the standard, we are proud to announce an expansion into other major cities across the country and around the world. There's no better way to bring the city right to your doorstep. Look for CTOS 2.0 in the new year. CTOS, the future at the touch of a button. Okay, is it over now? Yep, it's over. Woohoo! Let's just look at the progression. At five, it is complete. So I'll see you soon, guys. <laughs> sorry about, sorry about the series saying you know it's over now, it's over now. Um, yeah, it's definitely over. I'll see you soon in a new series. And then uh, yeah, bye for now.